in for you on April 16th, 2021. Here's, I'm gonna call video three of, of my almost completed DB224 conversion from 150 to 160 down to the hound band. Um, I just gotta tape up a few things, but I think I'm good with so far what I got. Uh, here's the rundown. I made a new harness and then welded, uh, extended the dipoles to uh, about 37, in my case, 37 and a quarter inch, and then welded them and then put some stainless steel screws through it to trust my weld and to back it up. Uh, the harness, uh, 146 and a half inches of a 35 ohm. There's the first dipole, second dipole, there's third and fourth. But the 35 ohm comes up to this junction and in it, uh, they're all spliced together. I made a, uh, some copper wrap. Uh, so 35 ohm, 146 inches to two uh, 35 ohm jumpers, one out going to the two top dipoles and another jumper. I think the specs are 66 and 5 eighths inches. So they go to each dipole. Uh, out of that 35 ohm comes up to two more tees, one at the top and the bottom to separate out the dipoles. Uh, then you get down to, well, there you can see it right there. RG83 is the 35 ohm and RG11 is the 75 ohm. So I made this, again, three of these devices, filled them up with silicon, uh, soldered up all the connectors. So you got 75 ohm, 43 inches coming up to uh, each uh, each leg, each dipole. Uh, my welding isn't isn't the very isn't the prettiest, that's for sure. But uh, hopefully it'll hold, and I've got all the screws in there placed too. So there's the top dipole, and here's the uh, again the the second leg that's uh, next to the top. This is the middle section, center section T, uh, 335 ohms, 146 inch from the bottom and 66 and 5 eighths to each other top. Uh, the other dipole going down. And here's the bottom T going to, this is the 75 ohm going to the bottom, 43, actually mine's 43 and a quarter. And then the top one going to the second from the bottom dipole. So uh, hopefully these little devices will work. I don't see why they won't. So that's the rundown. Oh, I added uh, with all the DB specs, I had to extend the very top. So uh, coming out of the top, I put in another piece of aluminum tubing and stainless steel screws going on up to the little lightning cap on top. Uh, I'll try to come up, I got the dimensions and all that, I'll try to come up and post that later on when I get to it sometime. Hope this helps somebody, and for really me.